Hi there, today's topic is outbound links. Outbound links are links from your website out to another site somewhere else on the web. And the question is, are they a good thing? So are you doing it? Should you be doing it? Stay tuned and find out more. Alright, so we're talking about outbound links, links from your site out to other sites on the web and trying to figure out if they're a good thing or not a good thing. Let's start with looking at your website. Your website, in my opinion, is the heart of your business online and you work really hard to pull in traffic from social media and other places from your mailing list to your website. Your website is really the one place where you can actually sell to people. So you don't want to be pushing people away from your website and driving a lot of traffic out to other sites, right? Well, in general, that's true. You do want to keep people on your website. However, it can be a good thing to have outbound links on your site. So why? Well, the search engines, they don't just use the keywords that you sprinkle through your pages to decide whether you're going to be a relevant and good search result for their searchers, they use a whole multitude of other criteria as well. They're always looking to provide quality search results to their searchers. That's how they stay in business. So one of those criteria that they use is actually looking at outbound links. Do your pages have links out to other websites? Now, the right kind of link is important. If you're linking out to some spammy junkie site, you're actually going to be hurting yourself much more than helping yourself. But if you're linking out to reputable sites, and by that I mean a large site with lots of traffic that provides good and helpful information, right, it, that is seen in general as a good resource, if you link to that kind of site that's related to what you're talking about, that is what Google, when I say Google I mean all the search engines, that's what Google's looking for. That's telling Google that you're trying to be helpful and useful by linking to relevant, reputable, extra information. So it shows that you could be linking to your sources, references, extra background information. So that's going to be helpful to your readers. And anything that you're doing to be helpful to your readers makes you good in Google's eyes. So consider when you're writing your pages and your blog posts, sprinkling in a few of these special kinds of outbound links to reputable, useful, related, quality websites, right? And then the Google gods will smile upon your site and give you a little extra credit when they're looking to rank your pages in their search results, okay? One bonus tip here, when you are doing outbound link to another site off your, you know, not within your own site, but out to another site that's external, make that link open in a new page. That way when people do click on it and go away from your site, your site is still open in their browser and you haven't entirely lost them. They can still come back to you. One question I'll leave you to ponder and we'll discuss it next time is should you be linking out to your own social media? Should you be linking out to your Facebook page, your Twitter account, etc.? That's a topic on its own, so I'm going to make it part two. So look for that in my next episode. That's it for today. If you found this useful, please share it with your friends and colleagues. And do come on over to juliewaterhouse.com if you're not subscribed to my newsletter yet. That's where I'll give you all the latest tips and tricks and things that I only share with my subscribers. The quickest way to get on the list if you're viewing this straight on YouTube is to text WordPress to 1-855-969-5300. That's it for today. I'll see you next time.